this room as consider yourself as a professional journalist. I, please raise your hand. Identity, cri identity crisis here. Um, <laughs> when we're trying to, you know, wear different hats, or journalist, professional journalist and advocates or ad uh, activist. But sometimes we confront, con confront in our own boundary, in our own, you know, um, territory. As a professional journalist, we're doing the perfect job. You know, we're doing as the best we can. But as an activist, sometimes you have different set of principles, and ethicals, and practice. So, if we identify ourselves as both, how are we going to survive without have the identity crisis? So why we need cross the boundary? Because there is a boundary, and because of uh, something that we really want to change from both sides, as a journalist and as activist. So I think that is uh, what I understand the importance of to be great, courageous enough to cross the boundary sometimes, or test the boundaries at least, to claim the more space. and advocacy was really, as, as would you agreed, are different. It's not the same thing because they have the different way of seeing. Seeing the world, like the activists, seeing the world need to be transformed. They, you know, they want to change. They want to transform the society. And they want to do it. They want the, the macro structure, you know, they use this um, macro in structural analysis when they discuss about what kind of transform transformation they want to make. Because I was in this crisis, so sometimes I confuse myself with uh, our hour when I mentioned about activists, and I said our hour, as I said, as, as a journalist, because I also a working uh, journalist for 10 years. Um, so excuse this, forgive me if I sometimes even more confused your, you know, everybody here. And they have different way of seeing and they have different way of doing. Advocacy is usually an ad activist. Um, they use the language is very technical. They are sometimes very academic and uh, full of jargons. That's why, you know, the, the media people will throw their news release, you know, into the garbage right away when they receive them because it was not interesting to the media, to the audience. And um, they would do the issue based, they use the issue based ad ad approach. Um, they will identify the issue they want to um, focus on, and they will, <coughs> excuse me, to contact the media, try to push this agenda into the media in order to change, um, to, uh, to, um, to reach the, the larger audience. And media have different language. I, I think everybody knows what the media language look like, and we're very good at it. And uh, we're using the storytelling uh, approach. The first of all, you are telling the story, but, you know, the the ad advocates sometimes, I think that we have to be um, honest that they sometimes not so good at telling a story. <music> Somehow, you know, overlapping, but not all of them. There's a, you know, the area that overlapping, but still different. Advocacy want to change the world the best way possible, and media want to report the, wor the world the best way possible. That's why we discussed, you know, how to improve our profession, um, how to improve, uh, mm, apply the new technology, or, you know, discuss more about how to do um, the ethical reporting, uh, investigative reporting, etc.